Hello everyone! Hello! 안녕하세요! Guys! Welcome to today's s o k o r e a n school. So guys, who are in this classroom right now? Let me see. And guys, you know what? I recovered from COVID. I'm really healthy right now. Can you hear my voice? It's better than our previous class, right? Isn't it? Alright, so let's see who is here. So if you're here, please say 안녕하세요 to me. So then I can check the students. All right, all right. So nobody is leaving comments right now until now. But yeah, I can wait for you guys. Okay. Let me see. So how was your day, everyone? Oh, Marlene. Hello, my tweet. 안녕하세요. Okay, okay. How are you today? It's really early morning in Indonesia, right? It's very early morning, I know. <laughs> oh, Leonardo Dossi, 안녕하세요. Hello, 안녕하세요. All right, so, wow, so many people are coming today. t r e v o n s i hello, 안녕하세요. So, we still have a few more minutes before we start. And are you guys ready to learn a new thing today? <laughs> okay, so what is your plan for this weekend, everyone? It's... Tuesday, I mean, what am I talking about? Well, it's Saturday in Korea. So what is your plan? Oh, k a v i s h i hello. And you changed your profile picture and Marlene, she too, right? Oh, it's almost 7 a.m. Mm, okay. Oh, Leonardo, I feel much better. Thank you, thank you. Okay, k a v i s h i and Marlene, you guys are so cute. All right, so let me see. So, are you guys ready? So, what is your plan for this weekend? For me, I'm going to clean my room and edit some videos. And I need to take a quick exam. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Mm. 이번 주말에는 그냥 잘 거예요. What a best weekend. What a best plan. Okay, you need some rest. Okay. I will go to the hospital. Why, Marlene? What happened? Why? Hanshi, hello. 안녕하세요. Okay. What happened to you, Marlene? Are you sick? You okay? What happened? Your eyes? Or maybe, <clears throat> sorry, something else? We, we all need to be healthy, guys. Don't have COVID and, you know. Hmm, I got a big accident yesterday. Oh, <gasps> car accident? What? Really? No way. W like, like, how? Liesel, Joy, Shi, hello. 좋은 아침입니다, 여러분. Good morning. Okay, good morning, guys. So we have like one more minute before we start. So, <laughs> so what happened to you, Marlene? I'm so worried about you. I hope my students are very healthy. Yeah, 자전거를 탈 거예요. 꼭, 꼭, 꼭. Wow, for sure, for real. Okay, I hope you can. All right. <gasps> Just have sprained my ankle. Oh, really? Your ankle? <gasps> It's not broken, right? Oh, Marlene, don't be sick. I hope you get better soon. So if you... Don't walk for a while, and if you be careful for a few days, it will be fine. Don't worry, don't worry. And take enough rest, and don't move a lot, alright? Don't move a lot, and just... It's better to stay at home for a few days. Yeah, so don't walk that much. Mm. Oh, you're okay. Oh, okay, okay that's fine, alright. I was so worried. <laughs> okay, so guys, it's time to begin. Today's class, so my voice is like old grandfather, but it's not about the, it's not because of the COVID. I just woke up just before, so that's why my voice is very low right now. Okay, so today is day 65. It's already day 65, guys. Look at this. c h u d a s h i hello, welcome. So look at this. We finished day one, two, and we are at... We're here. Oh, already. Better doing some exams, Marlene. <laughs> yeah, that's right. 
So we are already at day 65 and only like 35 lessons are left before we finish the whole textbook 100 days Korean grammar challenge. It's really fast, right? Mm, okay. <laughs> so did you guys prepare your textbook or anything like that? I hope so. Okay. So let's begin today's class. People in the group are so worried about me but oh yeah that's right marlene <coughs> everyone is so worried about you <laughs> okay like caring each other you know okay so what is today's topic <gasps> look at this oh it's a little bit long <laughs> but you guys can do it it's not that difficult it's very easy so guys what is arayo what does it mean, 알아요? What is the difference between 알아요 and 몰라요? Let's see, let's see if you guys know or not. 알아요 and 몰라요. 몰라요 is quite familiar, right? Like, oh, 몰라요, like this. So what do they mean? 알아요, 몰라요. Okay, Hanshi, perfect. And Judashi, Marlene, great job. So 알아요 means no. And 몰라요 means <laughs> what is 몰라요 then? That's very easy. You guys know that 몰라요. Okay, don't know. Perfect, perfect. So 뭐뭐 을줄 알아요. 뭐뭐 을줄 몰라요. Okay, Omarlene, 주다시 한시. Perfect. So look at this one, guys. So 을줄. It means how to, how to plus verb like this. So, 을줄 알아요. This one could be know how to do something. Know how to do something. And 을줄 몰라요 means I don't know how to do something. I don't know how to do something. So, 을줄 알아요. I know how to do something. 을줄 몰라요. I don't know how to do something. Okay. This is very easy, right? <coughs> this is very easy. Okay. So now, let's go to our textbook. And please open your textbook page. It's day 65. So it would be page 86. Already? Time really flies. We only have few more lessons. No way. No, so sad. Really? Ah, haha. Okay. So please open your textbook page A six, and it's day sixty five. And as you guys already know, the grammar is 을줄 알아요 or 을줄 몰라요. So like there are two kinds of grammars, right? So let's read the descriptions. It's very easy, guys. So this grammar expresses the ability or capacity and knowledge of a subject. Oh, okay, okay. Like knowledge, like know how to do something or don't know how to do something. Liaison is perfect. Great job. So like this, once more, once again, this grammar expresses the ability, capacity, and knowledge of a subject. I know how to or I don't know how to do something. Okay, so it is translated into know how to do something for 줄 알아요. And I don't know how to do something for 줄 몰라요. Very easy, very easy, right? So now let's take a look at the grammar rules. So there are two grammar rules as usual, right? <laughs> so also it's about the final consonant. Very easy. So if the verb stem ends with a final consonant, look at this. If the verb stem ends with a final consonant, then we can simply use verb stem plus 을줄 알아요. 을줄 알아요. So for example, what is this? Oh my gosh. <laughs> so let's go with this one. To eat, guys. 먹, 
있다. 플러스 을줄 알아요. Look at this guy. So, what should we do to make a verb stem? What should we do? We need to remove something, you know? <laughs> we need to remove something. I'm gonna make it bigger. So, what should we remove? I mean, about mokta verb. Okay, let's see. I cannot see any comments right now. <laughs> Is it lagging or not? Okay, Marlene, Hansi, Trevonsi, Leonardo. Oh, that was the answer. Great job. Kevin is perfect. So, first, we need to take off this ta. And this is a verb stem. Oh, and there is a final consonant. Look at this. There is a final consonant. That's why we need to add 을줄 알아요. So, it becomes 먹을 줄 알아요. Great job, guys. So, for example, um, so many people cannot eat spicy food, so let's go like this. Tteokbokki. Tteokbokki. Mogul jul. Arayo. I know how to eat tteokbokki. Like, I can eat tteokbokki, right? Okay, okay. I can eat tteokbokki. Or I know how to eat spicy tteokbokki. I can do it like this. 먹을 줄 알아요. So, when there is a final consonant, just add 을줄 알아요. 을줄 알아요. Very easy, right? And rule number two. Rule number two is here. If the verb stem doesn't have a final consonant, or the final consonant is 리을, and then... Very simple. Verb stem plus 리을 줄 알아요. Mm, okay. 리을 줄 알아요. Like this. Okay. So it's not that difficult, right? <laughs> if the verb stem doesn't have a final consonant, and then we need to add 리을 줄 알아요. Okay, 많이 매워요? Yeah, it's a very spicy like that. Okay. Some tteokbokkis are very spicy, but some are not. So we need to space between 을 and 줄 알아요. Perfect. Great question, Marlene. So there is a space. Space, space. Space, space. But verb stem plus 을, there is no space. They are connected. Great question. Okay, Marlene. Great job. So now let's take a look at the second grammar rule. So um, let's go with 한국어. 하다 plus 리을 줄 알아요 How can we combine them? 저는 매운 음식 진짜 좋아해요 Oh really? You really love spicy food same as me but it's not good for our stomach and what is that? liver you know? not liver lung? no it's not lung yeah, the stomach, right? Okay. <laughs> wow, okay, guys. So, how can we combine this two? 한국어 하다 plus 리을 줄 알아요. Mm, what can we do with these two grammar? I mean, two sentences or two phrases. First, we need to take off something. What should we take off? We need to take off. <laughs> we need to take off. Let's see. We eat salty food, but not spicy here. Oh, I love salty food too. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I really love salty food. Oh. Okay, Marlene, great job. Perfect sentence. Perfect. And Leonardo, that's right. And Hansi, Marlene, great job. So first, we need to take off this ta, And then, we need to add this too. This too, right? So the answer is... 한국어 할줄 알아요. I know how to speak Korean. I know how to speak Korean. Okay. Or if you don't know how to speak Korean, then maybe we can use this one. 한국어 할줄 몰라요. I don't know how to speak Korean. Okay. One of them. Mm. 
So guys, can you speak Korean? You need to choose one of them. Let me see. Can you guys speak Korean? Please answer me with this two. One of them. Okay, Gabby, she Leonardo, she perfect. So I'm gonna drink water. So can you guys speak Korean? Okay. <laughs> Let me see. Mm, okay, Gabby, she and Leonardo, so you can speak Korean. 한국어 할줄 알아요. Great job, great job. Okay. <laughs> so it's really important to distinguish them. Like, 을줄 알아요? 리줄 알아요? They are different, right? And, okay, Hanshi, but you can speak Korean though, Hanshi. You can speak Korean. Alright, so you need to distinguish when to use 리을 줄 알아요 or 을줄 알아요 and depends on the final consonants, right? of the verb stem Okay, great job guys So, and lastly Okay, Marlene Shi <laughs> 한국어 할줄 알아요 You don't have to speak Korean, right? Perfect So, oh and look at this There are a few more irregular verbs Okay so, as usual, there is also 듣다, which means to listen to or to hear, or 돕다, which means to help. Mm. They are irregulars. Alright, so 듣다, 듣다, to listen to. So, we need to change this 디귿 final consonant to the 리을 final consonant. So, it becomes 들을 줄 알아요. I can listen to something. Mm. 저는 한국어 말밖에 할줄 알아요. Oh, you only know how to speak Korean. But you know, like many other languages, you know, right? English and anything else. Yeah, so guys, this is irregular. So, 듣다 to 들을 줄 알아요. Mm, I know how to hear. Okay, and to help. 돕다. Mm. I wish I could answer more, but we do delivery during class time. Oh, really? We were listening and watching through the week. Okay, Judashi, I think you are listening my class with another person, right? It's really good to have a classmate. That's great, alright. So, Liazel-shi, perfect. Leonardo-shi, 물 몰라요. Oh, you don't know about water? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so, 돕다. Look at this. There is a P final consonant, but we can change this final consonant into U syllable. U. So, to U. To U. And it doesn't have any pachim, so we need to add this one. To U plus liil juraraya. So it becomes to juraraya. It's irregular. Oh, okay. Ah, jul molla. That's right. Okay. So guys, to irregulars, remember this. 들을 줄 알아요. 도울 줄 알아요. Okay. So now, let's take a look at some example sentences in our textbook. Okay. So number one, very easy. 한국 음식을 요리할 줄 알아요. Ooh, what does it mean? <laughs> 한국 음식을 요리할 줄 알아요. I know how to do something, but what kind of thing? <웃음> 한국 음식을 요리할 줄 알아요. 한국 음식을 요리할 줄 알아요. What does it mean? I know how to do something. Okay, I know how to cook Korean food. All right, <웃음> 개비 씨, perfect. Oh, 맞아요. 요리 means cook. Perfect. Great job. 주다시. That's right. And guys, can you guys cook Korean food? I will ask you. 여러분은 한국 음식을 요리할 줄 알아요? It's a question for you guys. <clears throat> okay, that's right. Marlene, great. And Gabby, she, 한국 음식 is Korean food. Perfect. Okay. So guys, which Korean food can you make? <coughs> Sorry, so which Korean food can you make? For me, I think I can make you no know, chapche or 
but I can I never I've never made kimchi before. Ah, uh, and maybe many other things like kimchi jjigae, denjang jjigae. I can cook, guys. I can cook. Oh, Leonardo Doshi, you know how to do. Maybe you need to try someday for sure. Okay. Kebish, wow, you can make bibimbap. Bibimbap har jul arayo. Great job. And very natural sentence. Okay. And Majayo Barlin, Tokpoki, Kimbap Chapchi, you are like master of Korean food, I know. <laughs> Prevonsi, you need to try for sure. Or you need to cook by yourself. Judashi, <gasps> Tokpoki, oh, that's so good. And Kebish, you can also make Kimbap. I cannot. Wow. So, Marlene, Judashi, Kebish, so good at cooking. Okay. So now. Let's go with second example sentence. <gasps> Look at this. 청국장 먹을 줄 알아요? Mm, do you guys know what 청국장 is? 청국장? Have you guys heard of this one? 청국장? <laughs> what is 청국장? It is a soup, a Korean traditional soup and Oh yeah, you know that, KBC Gray. So it's very similar to Tenjang Jige, but it smells a little bit bad. Yeah, the stinky soup. That's right. That's right. Perfect. Chungguk it a little bit smells. And it's like, I just see palemse. You know? Okay. All right, Marley, you don't know about this. So it's very uncommon food, I know. So. This is very similar to denjang jjigae, but it smells worse. But it tastes very similar. Okay. It tastes same though, yeah. So maybe you guys can try cheonggukjang when you come to Korea, but I don't really recommend this because many of my friends, I mean Korean friends, cannot also eat this cheonggukjang because it smells. <laughs> okay, so cheonggukjang. 먹을 줄 알아요? What does it mean? 청국장 먹을 줄 알아요. What does it mean? 청국장 먹을 줄 알아요. I know how to do something. <laughs> I gave you a lot of hints. 청국장 먹을 줄 알아요. Let's see, let's see everyone's comments. <laughs> 청국장 먹을 줄 알아요. <gasps> Anybody? Okay, Marlene. Gabby's great job. I know how to eat 청국장. Like stinky soup, you know. Okay, okay. Stinky soup is here. Oh my gosh. So 청국장 먹을 줄 알아요. Okay, and now let's go with the third sentence. The next one is this one. Oh, it's a question, guys. There is a question mark at the end of the sentence. 룩시 씨, 운전할 줄 알아요? What does it mean? 룩시 씨, 운전할 줄 알아요? 룩시 is a name, guys. 룩시, 운전할 줄 알아요? Do you know how to? <laughs> Do you know how to? I'm curious with 청국장. <gasps> oh, Marley, maybe. Uh, yeah, if you if you have tried denjang jjigae before, then you might like this. But yeah, some of young generations in Korean also cannot eat this. So maybe you can try someday, but I'm not sure about you will like it or not. Okay, Marlene, Leonardo, she, Gabby, she, perfect. Ruxi, do you know how to drive the car? Okay, 운전할 줄 알아요? So, 운전하다. We removed 다 and then added 리을 줄 알아요. So, 운전할 줄 알아요. Okay, and guys, do you know how to drive? Oh, 개비 씨 맞아요. 운전해요 means to drive. So, to everyone, 운전할 줄 알아요? 저는 운전할 줄 몰라요. Because I don't have driver's license yet. Okay, so, 운전할 줄 알아요? Do you know how to drive? Yeah, maybe you need to find. Yeah, that's good. Okay. <laughs> so guys, do you know how to drive? I know many students here are very young. 
like some of you guys are teenagers right yeah marlene you also cannot drive like me okay i also don't have driver's license but I get bored because I have to drive in the traffic jam. That's right. Yeah, especially when like working off time. Very heavy traffic jam is there, right? Okay. I wish I can get driver's license in this winter. Guys, please pray for me. I'm so scared about getting the driver's license. I don't know why, but it's too scary for me. Because whenever I drive in the game you know the, like driving game i always drive in reverse so but i learned how to drive with my friend oh that's good that's good that's important and marlene can you ride motorcycle then motorcycle i cannot <laughs> i can only ride bike okay so <laughs> please pray for me guys to get driver's license in this winter i really hope so okay oh <laughs> thank you kbc you don't have to right yeah maybe i wish i can drive in this christmas yeah for real okay 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 so sad let's go in next one. Oh, this is a little bit difficult word okay 대사관에 갈줄 몰라요. Oh, what does it mean? 대사관에 갈줄 몰라요. What is 대사관? Wow, you can motorbike, but you're not good at it. Yeah, but it's really cool to how to, like, knowing how to ride a motorcycle. Oh, that's really cool, Marlene. I want to ride with you. Can I sit back on you? <laughs> back of you? Okay, so guys, this one. What is 대사관? That's right, Gabby's embassy. Perfect, perfect. So, 대사관에 가다, to go to embassy. But there is no final consonant in this verb stem. So, we need to add 리을 줄 몰라요. Okay, Marlene, perfect. I don't know how to go to the embassy. Perfect. 대사관에 갈줄 몰라요. Great job, Gabby's. Okay. So, and we have one more sentence. Okay, this is very easy. 수영 씨는 수영할 줄 몰라요. What does it mean? What is 수영하다? 수영하다. What does it mean, guys? It's not that difficult, but is it? I think it's a basic verb, maybe. What is 수영하다? Can you guys guess its meaning? 수영하다. <laughs> Let's see, 수영하다. 수영하다. Okay. Mm, to swim, great job. Leonardo Doshi, Marlene, Gabby, she's perfect. So, 수영하다 is to swim. And there is no final consonant at the end of the verb stem because it's 수영하. So, we need to add 리을 줄 몰라요. So, 수현 씨는 수영할 줄 몰라요. Okay, Jongmi Shi, great job. And Gabi Shi, Suyeon doesn't know how to swim. Perfect, perfect. So do you guys know how to swim? 여러분은 수영할 줄 알아요? Can you guys know how to swim? For me, I can float on the water, but I think I cannot swim. Like, I can just do like dog swim, you know? I don't know how to say that in English, but yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Okay, so, mm, yeah, I can float in the water, but I, yeah, I can, I can go, I can swim, but I'm not really good at it. <gasps> oh, Leonardo Si, you know how to survive. Please teach me, please teach me. Jongmi Si, you don't know how to swim. Okay, but that was a great sentence, perfect. So, it's really important to know how to swim, right? Because it's really dangerous. Hmm. So it's better to, it would be better to learn. <laughs> okay. 저도 수영 몰라요. 저는 수영할 줄 몰라요. Okay. Guys, and now, 
there is few more example sentences so here is first one that i prepared for you guys so take a look at this 저는 한국어를 할줄 알아요 Ooh, what does it mean 저는 한국어를 할줄 알아요 i took swimming classes and i did taekwondo when i was younger oh hebi <gasps> wow which color of the band you know is that called band or i don't know yeah okay that's really great so what about this one 저는 한국어를 할줄 알아요 <laughs> what does it mean 한국어 is korean Oh, capital in English. So, 할줄 알아요. I know how to speak. Oh, okay, perfect. So, 하다. It literally means to do, but in this sentence, it's used for to speak, right? 저는 한국어를 할줄 알아요. Yeah, oh, that, uh, the word is for belt. That's right. White belt. That's so cute. Okay. Yeah, great job. Juda Shi, Marlene, Jungmi Shi, Leonardo Shi, Gabi Shi. Great job today. So, I know how to speak Korean. 저는 한국어를 할줄 알아요. And what if you don't know how to speak Korean? Which word can we use instead of 알아요? Yellow bells. Oh, that's good. Okay, okay. I've never learned Taekwondo before. <laughs> so, what about this one? So, how can I say... I don't know how to speak Korean. I don't know. 대박, Gabby. Yeah, 대박. Like yellow belts. It's not an easy thing. I know. Okay, 정미 씨, perfect. The answer is... 몰라요. I don't know how to speak Korean. So, there are two choices. <laughs> 고마워요, Marlene. <laughs> okay, Leonardo is great job. 몰라요, great job. And here is the second example sentence. Okay. 그 아이는 아직 글을 읽을 줄 몰라요. <gasps> what does it mean? Mm -hmm. What does it mean? 읽을 줄 몰라요. Alright, so what is the word 읽다? It means to, there is not enough space, right? To, <laughs> what does it mean, 읽다? We need to know this word because this is very important and basic verb. Let's see who can get the correct answer. Alright, 정미씨, perfect. It means to read. Great job. It means to read. Okay, that child doesn't know how to read yet. Great job. And Marlene, that's right. Could I means that kid or that child or that... Yeah, that kid is right. To read. Great job, everyone. Okay, so... 읽을 줄 몰라요. So first, we need to take off this 다. And then, add 을 줄 몰라요. Because there is a final consonant, right? 을줄 몰라요. And guys, take a look at this word. 아이 is kid or a child. And what about 아직? What is 아직? Hmm. What does it mean 아직? This is important, guys. What is 아직? 아직 means yeah, that's right, Leonardo said that kid still doesn't know how to read. Great job. Yet or still. Perfect, perfect. Yet or still. Great job. Oh my gosh. So good at it. Okay, everyone. Or yet. Perfect. So, that kid cannot read yet. Right? So, 글 is like, how can I say that? Writing. So, 글 means like writing in the book, you know. Okay, okay. So one more time. 그 아이는 아직 글을 읽을 줄 몰라요. So repeat after me. Let me go slower. 그 아이는 아직 글을 읽을 줄 몰라요. Repeat after me. 
Okay, I cannot hear everyone, but I hope everyone is repeating after me. I believe in you guys. Okay, and here is the last one. Okay, 그분은 요리를 할줄 몰라요. Oh, 몰라요 is finally here. So 그분은 요리를 할줄 몰라요. What does it mean? 그분은 요리를 할줄 몰라요. 그분. 그분. Okay. This is for a very formal word, which means, <laughs> which means, and 그 means that, right? That. And what about 분? Okay, okay, great job. Kevin, Marlene, Jung, Miss, great job. Okay, that person, perfect. So, 그분은 that person 요리를 할줄 몰라요. Okay, 할줄 몰라요, and don't know what to do. 요리, which means cook. 그분은 요리를 할줄 몰라요. Great job. That that person doesn't know how to cook okay so 분 is 분 means a person and this is for a formal expression so it's better than to better than using 그 사람 that person but 그분 is much honorific expression All right so that person doesn't know how to cook yet okay okay 주다시 perfect so 그분 요리를 할줄 몰라요 now I think everyone got today's grammar, right? So how was today's grammar? Was it easy or not? How was it? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Okay. 그 사람 is a casual way. That's right, Marilyn. Perfect. Okay. And 그 사람 might be a little bit rude, so it's really better to use 그분 when pointing someone okay <laughs> or talking about another person so how was today's grammar it was easy and fun oh thank you that was great okay Jungmi Shi. so and also there is a homework today guys so homework is making <laughs> 10 example sentences using today's grammar 을줄 알아요 or 을줄 몰라요 okay <laughs> 좋아요 so much fun and a little bit. All right, great job. So today's homework is making 10 example sentences and leave your comment down below for feedback, everyone. Okay, okay. So I hope everyone understood today's grammar very well. <laughs> and this is our live class schedule, guys. You are a great teacher and it's so easy. Thank you, Judashi, really. Okay, and KBC, thank you. Marlene, thank you so much. So thank you for joining today's lesson. And guys, maybe we have like two more minutes before we start. So yeah. <laughs> Why don't you make your own example sentence using today's grammar? Only one thing. For me, I can say, Oh, Jungmichi, thank you. Travelage, thank you so much. KBC, I love it too. So maybe I can make 저는 um, piano를 연주할 줄 알아요. I know how to play the piano. Oh, okay. This is my own sentence. And what about you guys? Can you guys play piano, or what can you do, or what can, what cannot, or you cannot do? All right. So for me, 저는 일본어를 할줄 몰라요. I don't know how to speak Japanese like this. Please make your own example sentences and leave them in the comments. So this is our live class schedule and don't forget to join next time too. And I hope to see everyone very soon again. And thank you so much. <laughs> okay, Marlene, maybe you can learn. Yeah, you can learn from me. <laughs> okay, so guys, thank you for joining today. And don't forget to review today's grammar. Always review. Okay, guys, have a great day and have a great weekend. Okay. Oh, you can...
You know how to play clarinet? That's so nice, Kebishi. Oh, thank you so much. So, hope to see you everyone very soon. Bye bye. Okay, Sam. Bye bye.